Good morning YouTube, um, what's everyone saying? Okay, so let's start this with a big, big just um, having a cup of tea with two tea bags, a lovely morning brew. You can never see it, but a little bit of milk. It's all that Dr. Apple mugs. Um, yeah, I'd just like to make a quick video to apologise to Danny and Christy. Um, now Danny... We fell out some time ago, and um, I think, you know, you, you had a bit of banter. You made a video, you called me Nurse Ringpole, and I didn't know whether you was bantering or you were serious, and I took it a bit to heart, and it was a bit silly of me. Um, I'd just like to apologise, and I mean that sincerely. Um, you are what we call a real fighting man who's busy fighting. Um, Keeping yourself in shape, um, winning titles, doing what a fighting man should do, fight, you know, and staying on a positive route, you know, we never see you on camera sat there feeling sorry for yourself or, you know, stuffing your face full of pancakes. Um, I've got to say, um, good luck. Next month, I know you're fighting. Is it Gerard Warren? Yeah, I think you've got this, mate. I think you've got this. Ranto, go on, Danny lad. And he, Danny, is living proof that you can turn your life around. You know, with positive thoughts. Um, you know, being humble, just staying grounded. He is living proof that anyone can change their life if you put the effort in. And you make amends for any wrongs you've done. You try and become a better man, a better, just a better individual. Do you know what I mean? He's a good man. And you can tell he's a good man, you know? And I jumped on the bandwagon. You know, I tried to make negative videos. I don't know why. Because Danny had never done anything to hurt me. You know what I mean? Like I said, I got slightly offended about the video. I mean, it was should have been just talking in fun, you know? But that's my big head in more ways than one, you know. Um, so I apologise, Danny, sincerely, from the heart, mate. You know, and I hope... And, you know, you continue with your BKFC career and you, you know, get continued success from it, you know. I wish you all the best. You know, you're a top bloke, you know what I mean, who brings positive videos, you know what I mean. I, I am subscribed. I've been watching, you know, for a long time now. I've ne never got round to actually saying it, and I've never got round to actually apologising, you know what I mean? It takes a bigger man to admit he was wrong, you know what I mean? I've messed up, big time. You are a decent guy, you're a good bloke, you're someone who I'd love to have a point with, you know? You're a real man's man, you know? You know, humble, you know, just a nice guy, just, you've got an aura about you, you know? I'd love to have a point with you, same with Martin. Same with Simon, you know, much respect, much love to Martin and Simon. Martin, top geezer, top fighter, R really strong, mate, really strong. Picking up these dumbbells he was, he was pressing them like, I don't know, like it was two empty milk bottles, you know. Got a lot of time for Martin, he's, he's one of the real ones, real genuine good guy. You know, he gives anyone... Like a second chance. That's 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 the kind of strength of the man's character, you know. It's good, good, good guy. And Simon, all the best, mate. With uh, YouTube Wars, Spartan Wars, it's gonna be big, mate. Keep 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 at it. I mean, good things take time, you know. You can't just throw out any old rubbish, you know. People fighting in scrapyards, you know, and whatnot, you know, with dogs running around, you know. It takes time to. Get the right fights, the right locations, the right audience, sell the right tickets. I wish you continued success, Simon. I think big things are coming early next year for Spartan Wars, YouTube Wars. It's going to be big. It is going to be big. It's going to it's gonna slowly rise up the ranks. You've got my back in all the way, mate. I'd love to come down, you know, and uh, watch some of the fights one time if you're there ever in the kind of dislocation, you know, all the best to you, Simon, you're a good guy, mate, good art, good family man, with good values, you know, and you know how to treat people, 
with respect and dignity. You know, um, yeah, I'm gonna do um, what is it? Um, self defense lesson episode 16 um, tomorrow because today I'm doing the old weightlifting. I'm gonna do the 135 pounds for my buddy from California, Big Trips. So I'm gonna push that weight out today. Gonna do it for an easy breezy. 20 I think you know 135 pounds which is about roughly 62 kilos it ain't you know in you know in the way we do it we do it in kilos the Americans do it in pounds um but yeah I'll have that up so self-defense lesson but the self-defense lessons I'd like to take them around the country if that's possible I'd like to do like seminars you know like in like dojos just around the country, but what I would need, and I wouldn't need this for protection of myself, obviously, but I would like a little security team around me, you know, just to, if I'm going to talk or display any demonstration, you know, just to keep the trouble troublemakers at bay, you know, and I don't mind if the securities have got Halloween masks on, you know, or I've only just met them, you know what I mean, if I've, you know, met them like a couple of weeks ago, as long as they say they're supporting me, if they say they're supporting me, it doesn't matter, if they've been supporting me just yesterday, it doesn't matter if they wear a mask, you can be my security, you can, you're, you're on Doc's team, you're going to be part of the winning team, you know, so, yeah, um, we're going to move up, we're going to move in a, in a positive way, do you know what I mean, yeah, I, I still miss me old dog from 10 years ago, you know, miss me nana, miss me nana, miss scan to the bingo with me nana, you know, and, you know, and I just miss, you know, but uh, I speak to me mum every day anyway, I always speak to me mum on the phone, a few times a day, you know what I mean, you know, and uh, just try and, you know, staying on this uh, positive vibe, you know, um, you know, just having now strong, t whoops, look at that, look, the coaster's come off, <laughs> a nice little bro there, two tea bags. I like it extra strong. I used to put a little bit of cold water in it because I didn't like it too hot, but now I like it hot because I've, my throat is always sore, you know, so. But yeah, I hope everyone's having a positive day. As you can see, I'm back to normal. I'm in good mood. Things are working out okay now. Don't worry because, let's put it this way, the doc has got his eye on someone and things are looking up. If you get me, <laughs> Ah, you can't teach an old dog new tricks. Yes, you can. <laughs> I'm living proof of that. But yeah, everybody, have, have a great day. Uh, stay positive. Um, stay in the zones. Take your ashwagandha. Um, take your vitamins. Say your prayers. Um, and hopefully I'll get that um, lifting video up by the end of the day. And uh, yeah, I wish everyone... The, um, for everyone that's left such... Positive and supportive messages in the in the comments. I truly appreciate that from the heart. Truly appreciate that. And Danny, you don't have to forgive me. I'm, you know, that is your personal opinion. But you're a good man, and I apologise. And you know, I will never go on that negative path towards you again. You know, I've seen my eyes have been opened recently, and I've seen. Who really is the bad guys and who really is the good guys? And I often pick the wrong team, you know. I often, you know, have me rose tinted glasses on. I let someone who's clearly could not be a good person sweet talk me into believing their way of thinking, their narrative, you know. And I, you know, I fall for it. And I've got a big heart, you know. I'm. Um, just that's how I am sometimes. I am easily led, especially when I feel someone's the underdog. But Danny's given me the inspiration where I'd like to start at least training again. You know, I don't won't be sparring anymore, won't be fighting anymore, but I want to start training again. You know, getting busy with the hands, doing some pad work, you know what I mean? And just the guys live in proof that anyone can change their life, turn their life around for the better if they actually put the, you know, the thought into it, the effort into it, the heart into it, you know, effort, heart goes a long way, this country, this man is a working man, I think he's got about two, three jobs, as well as being our, our BKFC champion from the good old UK, 
Can't say better than that. You know, we have a champion, and this guy is going to win his next fight in November. I'm guessing second round KO for Danny. Go on, Danny. People, speak to you later. God bless.